suspense. or I'm not going to be responsible for what happens. Go away, kid, and stop calling me Hugo. The name is Hugo. All right, Hugo. I'm not leaving until you tell me where you hid that cattle money you stole. I'll give you just five seconds to come clean. Then what happens? You'll see. Uh. One, two, three, four. Did you proved you can count? Go soak your head. You're all wet. Yeah? Tag, what in the world's going on? What are you up to? Oh, nothing much, Lofty. I was just trying to convince Hugo Baird he should tell us where he hid that stolen money. I'm afraid it would take more than a bucket of water, Tag. You bet your sweet life it would. And more than the questions you two have been tossing at me. You better get used to questions, Barrett. The circuit court will have plenty of them for you. Listen, Deputy. They might have questions, but they won't get any answers, even if I'm around to be asked. Oh? You planning on leaving us? I might be. I get a lot of dough stashed away once I bust out of here. Well, if I were you, I wouldn't go making up any shopping lists. I think I'll go out, Annie. That is, unless you need me. Before you go anywhere, young man, you put that water bucket back where it belongs. It's there for a purpose, you know. Sure, sis. <laughs> so long, Hugo! <laughs> Looks like Tag didn't take any of the fire out of Hugo Barrett, Annie. He still thinks he's gonna bust out of jail. I think you can escape, if we set our minds to it, Lofton. What's going on on that pretty blonde head of yours? A jailbreak. You mean let you go bust out? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Talk about your dizzy blonde. It's not so dizzy. I think it might work. Do you want me to go hand him a key? No. If he did that, I'm afraid he'd know something was up. Look, Annie, I hate to seem thick, but just what are you talking about? Well, we agree that Barrett isn't going to tell us where he hid the money from the Cattlemen's Association, don't we? Yeah. And all we have is a suspicion that he hid it somewhere on the Mesa, right? Mm-hmm. And if we don't find it, then half the cattlemen in the territory are going to be out of business. So far, so good. What now? So, now we let Hugo Barrett escape, trail him to the money. Hey, that's not a half bad idea. As a matter of fact, I'm glad I thought of it. Well, you just remember that in case anything happens. Why, what do you mean? Well, if it doesn't work, the good citizens of Diablo are going to want somebody's scalp for letting a prisoner escape. Annie? Nope. Guess he went out someplace. You mean you've been here all alone, haven't tried your escape act? I got plenty. All right, deputy. The escape act is starting right now. Open this cell. Go on, open it. I'm really going to enjoy this. Wait a minute, Hugo. Pull that trigger, the whole town will be down on you. Say, that's right. You know, for a lawman, you make pretty good sense. Go on, get in there. Where's your horse? My back. Get in there.
Daniel, are you all right? Yeah. Your bright plan didn't call for this, did it? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sure you're giving Barrett the gun. Well, I'm just glad he didn't try to use it. For a minute there, I thought I was going to have to shoot him loose. You thought? Where's Tag? I'm figuring up new ways to find that money, I suppose. Did you get Jim Hanks to look after him while we were gone? Sure did. Filed shoes in that horse ought to make easy trailing, any? Let's hope they work, Lossie. And cut a trail when he reaches the mesa. So far, so good, Annie. Can't be too far ahead of us. We'll give him a chance to pick up the money. Then we'll have to move fast. Well, we might as well get it going, Pixie. Can't find that money just standing around here. We might be big heroes if we find it. Might even get a big reward or something. Somewhere on the mesa, and he said so. Looking for something, kid? Hugo! That's right, and right out here on the mesa, where I can take care of you and teach you some manners. Get down off of there. But let me go, let me go! <laughs> I'll let you go, kid. Won't you tell me what you were snooping around here for? I was looking for that money you stole. What makes you think it's out here in the Mesa? Because Annie said so, and Annie's never wrong about anything. Listen, kiddo, we all make mistakes. She and that deputy made one, and here I am. Yeah. How'd you get out of jail? <laughs> I squeezed through a crack in a wall. Yeah, like a rat, huh? Oh, you. All right, kid. You're so interested in that money, I'll show you just how close you came. Look under those rocks. Holy Toledo! Too bad you're not going to be able to spend this. <laughs> oh, kid, you got quite an imagination. You just wait till Annie catches up with you. Listen, by the time she picks up my trail, I'll be so far out of this territory, she won't know where to start looking. You suppose I'm not going to tell her which way you went? What makes you think I'm going to leave you around here to tell anybody anything? What's the matter? Losing your nerves, Hugo? Shut up, kid. I thought I heard something. Let's get out of here. Get out. Get out, get out. Like he joined someone here. Whoever he met was riding a pony. Those tracks are much smaller. I don't suppose it could have been tagged. 
I don't know, Lofty. That crazy brother of mine said he had some more ideas about finding that stolen money. That kid and this gun goes off. It is Tag. Let's go get him. No, wait, Lofty. We're gonna have to let Barrett play his hand. As long as Tag's with him, he's got all the high cards. Hey, deputy! You and Oakley mount up and ride out of here. I've got the kid. Either get out or he dies. Let him go first. Then we'll go. Not a chance. This kid's my insurance for a safe ticket all the way to the border. You try and trail me and I'll kill him. He's got the money! Shut up! Well, my plan's really backfired, Lofty. You couldn't figure on Tag being out here, Annie. It's not your fault. You think you can get a clean shot at him? I can't take a chance, as long as he's got that gun on Tag. You win, Barrett. We'll turn back. Kid and mount up, we get a lot of riding to do. Where are you taking me? I want you to meet a couple friends of mine. Since when does a guy like you have any friends? Come on, come on, mount up. This isn't going to be easy, Annie. We're going to have to trail pretty far back. I know, Lofty. But I'll track Barrett all the way to the coast if it's necessary. And if he harms Tag... That poor kid is probably scared to death. Give me the canteen, kid. Ooh. Thirsty? Hugo? Come on, give it to me and cut out the Hugo stuff. I'm telling you for the last time, my name is Hugo. And my name is Hugo. Come on, let's have it. Sure, Hugo. Anything you say. What are you, crazy or something? You said give you the canteen. Well, upside down, I didn't. How am I supposed to know that if you don't make your directions clear? I'm just a kid. Well, I ought to break your neck. Remember, I'm your insurance. Get moving. Okay, Hugo. Heading for the canyon area, Annie. Well, he's got to stop sooner or later, and when he does, we'll make a move. Barrett and some kid with him. How are you, Barrett? Hi, Jack. All right, kid, get down out of that saddle. Come on, hurry it up. Leaf inside? Yeah. Let me go, will you? Hi, Leif. Ain't seen you in quite a spell. But you were locked up in the Diablo jail, Barrett. But yeah, that was just temporary. Yeah, he snuck out through a crack in the wall. 
Who's the fresh kid? Tag Oakley. Annie Oakley's kid brother? Yeah, that's right. You crazy or something? Right the first time. Crazy as a hoot owl. Is Annie Oakley on your trail? You're darn right she is. Now, wait a minute. The kid's just talking. Besides, as long as I've got him, we ain't got a thing to worry about. Yeah, she trailed me all right. She and that deputy. But uh, when I played my ace in the hole here, they both turned back. Yeah, just in case we'll keep a guard out. Jack's right. You know, we ain't exactly been preaching sermons the past few weeks. And if I know that Oakley dame, she don't give up so easy. She's not part of our plan. Now, wait a minute, boys. Maybe you'll change your mind when you see this. Maybe this will make you change your plans. Never saw a more pleasant change. Listen, you two help me get this across the border, and I'll cut you both in good. Yeah, he'll cut your throats. You got the kid. What do you need our help for? I need your guns in case I run into trouble. What do you say, Jack? For that, I'll do a lot of shooting. And a lot of time in the penitentiary. How do you shut him up? Now, don't worry about him. Once I get across the border, I'll take care of him personal. Well, is it a deal? Good. When do we start riding? Well, as soon as I get some grub and a little rest, we'll leave along about sundown. Some grub cooking in the kitchen. Good. That'll get this kid out of our hair. Come on. All right, you, serve it up. I'll keep watch outside. Approach without being seen, Annie. We'll have to wait till it's dark. We could chance it now, but... No, Lucky, not with Tag in there. We can't afford to take any chances. You'll be all right, Annie. Now, take it easy. I wish I could, Lofty, but I can't help but think about Tag. Oh, he's so young. What can he do? Jack. Everything all right out there, Jack? All clear. Good. Well, it's about time. You'll find it's been worth waiting for, Hugo. Hugo? Oh, 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 oh. I never did know your first name, Barrett. Say, that's some handle. All right, you guys, cut out kidding me. We got a lot of riding to do. Eat. You gonna eat, kid? No, I'm not very hungry. <coughs> Take our chances on that, kid. Eat it. Come on, kid. Start eating it. Come on, come on. Now swallow it. Come on, swallow it. Now we'll get the last laugh, kid. 
When you finish that one, you can start on this plate. Oh. You got any more grub here? No, that was it. Jack, ride down to the outpost store and pick up something. We'll keep watch at the window. And while you're down there, pick up enough supplies for our ride. Yeah, there's an old buckboard around back. Hitch your horse up and take that. Okay. And all the time he's gone, kid, you just keep right on eating. Suppose he's headed, Annie. Probably for supplies since he took the buckboard. Shall we grab him now? No, it wouldn't do any good. We'll have to wait till he gets back. You got that look in your eye, Annie. What's in your mind? Have you ever heard of the Trojan horse, Lofty? Yeah. Wooden horse full of soldiers they pushed inside the city of Troy. What's that got to do with our problem? Well, that buckboard is going to be our Trojan horse. Yeah. What is this, a hold-up? Yeah, something like that. Take off that hat and let's close. Do as you're told. Get a rope, Lofty. All right, Annie. You Annie Oakley? Now you get the picture. I enjoy the food, wise guy. And food sort of took the wiseness out of him. Yeah. <laughs> Here comes Jack. It's about time he took long enough. He's here now. I'll give Jack a hand. Oh, never mind. He can manage. Come on, kid. Keep right on eating. Take care of the stove fire. for being a little sick from eating my own cooking. Well, I don't think Hugo and his friend are gonna like the food where they're going, either. I don't think they like mine, either. Have a bite? Mm -hmm. No, thanks, Tag. Come on, boys. We'll pick up your partner and get all three of you back to jail where you belong. You sure went to a lot of trouble for this money you'll never spend, Barrett. This kid brother of yours is a lot more trouble than any robbery. It's sure gonna be good to get rid of him. You'll have about 20 years to enjoy it, Hugo. Come on. Uh... On your horse, Barrett. Oh, <laughs> 